The Japanese mobile phone industry is one of the most advanced in the world. As of July 31, 2013 there were 139,180,300 mobile phones in use in Japan. This is 110% of Japan's total population according to the Ministry of Internal Affairs and Communications. In Japanese, mobile phone handsets, Exi Dai Dian Hua Duan Mo Kitaiden Wa Tanmatsu are often referred to as simply Kitai Denwa Exi Dai Dian Hua or Kitai Exi Dai for short. Topic: History In the year 1979, Nippon Telegraph and Telephone NTT launched the world's first first-generation mobile phone service in Tokyo as a car phone. In 1985, NTT offered Japan's first mobile phone service, called the Shoulder Phone. In 1988, Mobile Communication Group, which later was absorbed into KDDI, started mobile phone service. In 1993, NTT Docomo started its first digital mobile phone service 2G, using a time division multiple access TDMA variant called Personal Digital Cellular. In 1994, Digital Phone Group and Two Car Group, both of which later became SoftBank Mobile, started mobile phone service. In the same year, DDI Pocket, a subsidiary of KDDI, started PHS Mobile Phone Service. In 1999, NTT Docomo started iMode Internet Service. In 2001, NTT Docomo premiered the world's first third-generation mobile phone service 3G, using WCDMA technology called FOMA. In 2002, KDDI started 3G service in Okinawa, using CDMA 2000 technology. In the same year, JPhone started 3G service using WCDMA technology. In 2003, JPhone changed its name to Vodafone. In 2006, Vodafone Japan was purchased by SoftBank and renamed to SoftBank Mobile. In the same year, MNP mobile number portability was introduced. In 2007, Japanese regulator introduced new guideline for unbundling new handset price and service plan. In 2010, SoftBank Mobile stopped all non-3G services, focusing on 3G service only. Topic. Providers There are four cellular service operators in Japan. Wilcom is the last PHS personal handy phone system service operator. NTT Docomo Docomo was spun off in 1991 from Nippon Telegraph and Telephone NTT. NTT Docomo first offered its second-generation service known as Personal Digital Cellular PDC. It now offers a 3G service using WCDMA technology known as FOMA. The company is operating a world-band WCDMA network at 2100 MHz. As of March 2016, the number of subscribers is 71 million. KDDI KDDI was formed by the merger of KDD International Phone Service Operator, DDI Nationwide CDMA Operator except for Kanto and Takai Area, and Edo CDMA Operator for Kanto and Takai Area in 2000. They offer the O Mobile Phone Service, its second generation service, using CDMA technology, and 3G service, using CDMA 2000. Their operating bands are 800 MHz and 2100 MHz. As of March 2016, there are 46 million subscribers. <laughs> SoftBank Mobile SoftBank Mobile is a subsidiary of SoftBank. SoftBank purchased Vodafone Japan at $15 billion in 2006. SoftBank Mobile now offers 3G service using WCDMA technology at 2100 MHz. SoftBank Mobile was also the exclusive service provider of Apple's iPhone in Japan until November 2011. As of March 2016, there were 40 million subscribers. Topic: <laughs> Why Mobile Y, Mobile, formerly EMOBILE, is the most recent entrant into the 3G market. Beginning in 2005, it has provided 3G data and voice service coverage to 90% of the Japanese population through its own network and a roaming agreement with NTT Docomo. 
Their band is 1700 MHz which is not compatible with other areas WCDMA phone. As of December 2013, the projected subscriber base was over 10 million subscribers. Topic industry The Japanese mobile phone market is known for its extremely competitive and saturated market, which, combined with a complex regulatory environment, has led to growing consolidation among manufacturers and providers alike. Mobile telecommunications operating licenses are administered by the Ministry of Internal Affairs and Communications. In Japan, there have never been banned license auctions. Usually Mike issues operating licenses by just paper checking. Collaboration by the various companies can be seen at the Yokosuka Research Park, near NTT's Yokosuka R&D Center, where many manufacturers have research and development laboratories offices. An outdoor testing site is also located there. Since the introduction of new regulations about unbundling service plan and handset prices in 2008, the Japanese handset market has shrunk. At its peak in 2007, the total handset shipping amount was roughly 52 M units. However, the number for 2009 was roughly 32 M units. This caused a serious recession for the handset industry and a consolidation of companies due to the reliance which handset vendors had on the Japanese market. Japan's PHS technology has been exported to China, Taiwan, and other countries. NTT Docomo's iMode web technology had been used by Australia's Telstra, Russia's Mobile Telesystems, UK's O2 and a few other mobile service providers overseas. NTT has been one of the main contributors to the 3G WCDMA standard. NTT Docomo collaborated with AT&T Mobility to set up a 3G-compatible mobile phone network in Hawaii. Topic: Handsets. Topic: Manufacturers. The following manufacturers currently market and sell handsets within Japan. Sanyo Electric, although formerly an independent manufacturer of handsets, sold its handset business to Kyocera in 2008. Mitsubishi Electric exited the mobile phone market in April 2008. Nokia discontinued development of mobile phones for the Japanese market in 2009. The Docomo M702 is, released in December 2006, was the last Motorola phone launched in Japan until their return to the market in 2011. Japanese manufacturers have had difficulty marketing their phones overseas. In 2009, out of all Japanese handset manufacturers, Sony Ericsson now called Sony Mobile sold the most handsets worldwide after non-Japanese Nokia, Samsung, LG Electronics and Motorola. Domestically, Sharp sold one quarter of the Japanese market, followed by Fujitsu, Panasonic, NEC and Kyocera. Topic: <laughs> Operating system Japan's mobile phones traditionally used the ITRON operating system, but as the functions become more complex, they moved over to more generally used operating systems, such as Symbian OS, Embedded Linux, Windows Mobile and Android. Most handsets on the market today use Android. <laughs> <laughs> Language input Input on mobile phones is performed using hiragana, katakana, kanji, and alphanumeric characters. A character mode function allows the user to select from among these types of character input. Kanji characters are selected by first inputting hiragana, then converting henken the characters. Kana characters are laid out on the mobile phone keys in the 50 character table format, a column characters on one key, car column characters on the two key, etc. The alphabetic character mode allows input of Roman characters, however, English language word prediction such as T9 is rarely implemented in Japanese handsets. Support for other languages and character sets, such as French, Russian, Cyrillic, and Chinese both traditional and simplified characters, is not standard on handsets from domestic manufacturers. Other characteristics The Japanese are known for their development of emoji, hui wenzi lit, picture characters, and ka emoji, yan wenzi lit, face characters, to express emotions in email messages. A large number and variety of emoji and ka emoji are available on handsets. Foreign manufacturers, such as Apple, in order to ensure compatibility with Japanese made handsets, have introduced emoji on their handsets around the world. Gmail and other email services have also introduced emoji that can be sent and received from mobile handsets as well as computers. Topic: 
Topic: <laughs> Unique business practices. All handsets sold in Japan were formally locked for use in Japan only due to the demands of service providers. Likewise, providers also refused to sell USIM cards by themselves without a handset or for a handset brought in from overseas, although NTT Docomo has recently relaxed this business practice. In accordance with the recommendations of the Ministry of Internal Affairs and Communications Mobile Business Consultative Committee, some Japanese phone manufacturers began to produce unlocked handsets in 2011. Sharp, Fujitsu, NEC and Panasonic now offer a number of unlocked handsets. See also Japanese mobile phone culture Telecommunications in Japan Mobile phone industry in China Mobile phone industry in Russia Mobile phone industry in India Mobile phone industry in South Korea Mobile phone industry in the United States <laughs>